Yo, what's up, guys? Today we are reacting to this video, which is called The Art of KGF. This is basically the science behind KGF part two. It's from the same channel. This channel only has two videos, and both of the videos, I suppose, I guess, is a masterpiece. Um, I haven't seen this part two yet. We're going to react to it together. But number one, the first video was a masterpiece. So guys go check out the channel the link is in the description it's called antagonism and hey if you're a kgf fan let me know in the comments down below <laughs> as if you wouldn't be <laughs> everyone's a fake kgf fan let's go <clears throat> don't forget to like and subscribe it is the anticipation of a reward not the fulfillment of it that what that was too fast that gets us to take actions. James Clear. That's true. In the last video, Science Behind KGF, we tried to decode and explain the world of KGF Chapter 1 and even went as far as reaching out to the director, Prashant Neel, for a podcast in hopes of gaining even more insight. But Did you get it? Not that I cared. After watching KGF... Oh, come on! Come on! It would be easier if Prashant Neil still had Twitter. If chapter 2 in theatres, being mesmerized, started to binge watch interviews from the makers. Cinema is uh, an art. Science is a whole game of start Science is a whole game of Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Prashant Yol was saying they started to compare it with science. He was talking about antagonism. Now I thought of making a video for KGF Chapter 2. And it cannot go unfinished. Yo, this man, antagonism, if you're watching. I want to make a video of the series of KGF Chapter 3. You can reach out to me on Twitter or Instagram or here on YouTube. Leave a comment and we can collab and work together, you know, if you want to. The story. Cinema is about storytelling. Art of KG Dorado. That's a nice edit, bro. He's gonna get his podcast. Fasten your seatbelts. Misosan is a term used in film and theater to describe the visual arrangement of all the elements within a particular shot or scene. The positioning of the characters, the use of props, lighting, clothing, set design, as well as the camera angle and framing are all included in this. Now, look at this concept from Taoism. A Chinese philosophical idea known as yin yang refers to two complementary yet conflicting elements that dominate every aspect of the universe. This idea is used to represent balance and harmony between opposing forces. This yin yang concept from Taoism is incorporated in KGF movie through color palette and even in staging of characters. Although yin yang are opposite, they also transform into each other. Interesting. Black and in white. In this particular scene, Adhira completes a circle around Rocky after showing him a taste of defeat. And you can observe here that Rocky completing the circle. They both complete a circle around the opposite force, which completes Yin Yang circle. Interesting. Here are a few notable. You know um, who uses that concept? Um, it's uh, Game of Thrones. If you watch Game of Thrones, you see this whole concept. Um, whatever happens to like whatever the the character does in the future in the future episodes it 
probably happens to him in the same way. So it's kind of like, you know, it goes back to to get him. It's very interesting. You know, Game of Thrones is very well written. Callbacks and comebacks. Interesting. Interesting. Bro, KGF has so many layers. There's so many connections. You have to watch this movie so many times for you get to, you know, for you to see all the details. Cross cuts. Take it from the top so that everyone knows. Cross cutting involves cutting back and forth between two or more scenes that are happening simultaneously, often to create tension or suspense. A well executed cross cutting in film editing allows viewers to suspend disbelief and process multiple scenes as though they're taking place concurrently. One of the best edited cross cutting is this interval sequence where nine different narrative is cut into one single sequence. Intercutting involves cutting back and forth between two or more scenes that are thematically or narratively related, but may not be happening at exactly the same time. The best intercut sequence is in the second half of the movie where there are scenes cross cut from different point of views to different timelines which is perfectly hand stitched in this sequence. Bro. This technique can tell Bro, oh, this, this analysis is amazing. Objects, make a story more engaging by skipping over unnecessary details. <laughs> Emphasize the link between different scenes. Show contrast between different scenes. History tells us that powerful people Add drama or tension. Summarize some action or narrative development. Make places powerful. Yo, guys, the editing, the the uh, the eye for detail, the the whole color palette, everything. These things are what I mentioned on my review. Everything that KGF does, there is. A reason behind it there's nothing that goes unseen they always do something that will be explained in, in in future references or even past references so everything is connected and the editing is something that called my attention when I when I saw KGF for the very first time it's very fast-paced and if you're not paying attention closely you're gonna miss a lot of detail and this is something that is very hard to do unless you have a very good script writer if the script is intact is impeccable then the director can you know um recreate it to to the scene and to the screen and the writing is amazing and it goes together with the editing this is teamwork bro kgf for, for those of you who might not understand why it's so su successful, it's because it was planned to the very brim to be successful.
it was it was all the music the everything it's just a very well thought of thought out of thought of thought of, well thought out uh, movie it was very well made the production production crew is amazing make a script shorter by eliminating multiple scenes cross cut from different point of views to different timelines intercut a useful tool to handle simultaneous action in any screenplay adre speed matra yavattu kammi agala this sequence is an editing brilliance <coughs> fasten your seat belts <laughs> even if there are no parallel scenes that are going on at the same time the director uses dialogues that intercut one another like this particular scene In KGF chapter 1 13 seconds was longest shot but in chapter 2 it is 45 seconds with no cuts yeah so this is the the, the thing that i mentioned in my review um KGF chapter 1 had a lot of cuts and it was fast paced while KGF chapter 2 was very you know um the the scenes were were longer i i mentioned that 43 seconds for for a scene is a lot without a cut this is a tool for explaining the rules of the director's world the knowledge about the place biography and characters that the audience needs to know in order to grasp and follow the story's developments it is used to delay information kgf nalli ಅಧಿಕಾರಿಗೆ often filmmakers will communicate their message through the media in their universe ondu pustaka barthiddare pravalayadalli udyami rajendra desai gundetininda saavannappittare whether it be a newspaper or television program some of the brilliant examples are vijendra ingligi explaining what has happened in kgf to deepa hegde vanaram explaining about the analogy of tiger and deer to the children ragavan explaining about the younger version of rocky to remika sen Bro, this is so deep. Like everybody, everybody who watches the movie, they 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 don't know what they're feeling. But everything was thought exactly like the director Prashant Neel. He knew exactly what he wanted you to feel. You just didn't know how he was doing it. And you know this explanation is perfect for you know. understanding the 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 mechanisms and the techniques and the strategies a great character acts as audience and vijendra ingligi acts as the storyteller who gives all the necessary information or did he the rocky conquering india is visually represented by two drone shots of rocky walking from kanyakumari to kashmir Whenever Rocky lights up a cigarette with his lighter that indicates that Rocky has full control over the situation. <laughs> Bro, this is amazing. The only time it will not light up is when Rocky is feeling that some things are going out of control. Rocky takes control over the situation and that is shown visually by lighting a cigarette. Rocky throws a cigarette that represents Rocky loses control over the situation. Bro, that is insane. The amount of detail. Matte kaigalanna jodsi hosa aata shuru madidare. KGF 1 and 2 are two different chess games which is also mentioned in one of the dialogues. Rocky is the king in KGF chapter 2 
which is also shown visually. The climax portion was just like an intense end game of chess. Bro, I love the chess references. But at the end there was no checkmate, rather it was a stalemate. A situation in which further action or progress by opposing or competing parties seems impossible. Bro, the, I would love to know how many times this man watched KGF 1 and 2. Bro. Bro. <laughs> okay, we're 10 minutes into the video. Do you guys know anything else that may have been um, overseen? Let me know in the comments. Guys, let me know your theories. Let me know your, your thoughts of KGF, KGF Chapter 2. Anything that you know, that would be awesome. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and to this man's channel because he is a great, great video maker. He only has two videos. His channel should blow up, man. Words that describe character's personality. If Rocky was working in a corporate office, how would his resume be like? CEO of India. Rajakrishna Pabberia. Address. Kolar, Karnataka. India. India. Nan Sama Niva Yudda Tapsak Pretnastini. Agila Andre. Get the guilty. Character traits. Problem solving. Critical thinking. Self motivated. Stylish. <laughs> Experiences. All the way from Bombay shooter to now. Currently CEO of India. <laughs> Smoking cigarette is his hobby. Ambitious. Very Can ambitious. Seen through his actions. <coughs> Visionary. KGF. Dunia. Dunia. Market research. Before starting off any project. Rocky studies and does proper market research. Quick learner. When Rocky meets Inayat Khalil, he comes to know the value of powerful weapons. And from that moment, Kalash. he starts to invest time and money in getting more powerful weapons. Kalash he also scouted the the area before he found the map. He was counting and analyzing and planning before he found the map. Like he had to blow up a truck and, and you know, as a distraction, everything was very well calculated. Before this incident, his whole army that will be having part of only the research, guns, which will not be more effective. He learns this and implements to get new weapons to his army. Upgrade. You can see the repercussion of this learning in police station scene as well as in KGF chapter 1 while he comes to purchase new weapons from a supplier. He's a businessman. The biggest businessman. Symbols and motif. Everything in this film has a purpose. Motif is any recurring element that has symbolic significance in a storyline. This enables to operate on more than one level. This helps to reveal theme of a film. Motifs are frequently associated with a theme. He's got very little time. You see, from when, when I watched KGF 1 and KGF 2, there was a sense of emergency. There, I felt like, bro, it, it was... A lot of things happening at the same time and the, the stakes were high and then it was a sense of emergency you had to that you know it felt like something was about to go down and you know it kept the adrenaline going and the blood flowing and it was it was it kept you on on edge time to progress time Director keeps bringing up these elements again and again. There is a theme which is being communicated subconsciously.
तुम रॉकी वार्निंग को टिप्पू नेगे खेड़ा तोड़ो ना पब बम्बा ये लीता ने रॉकी There must be another copy of order. It's so much. Shetty boy, get your lucky boy. Of course. हो गया काम अब ये Shetty boy. Control. Bombay refinery चलो. पूरा consignment रोक दो. ठीक सुना. रोक दो. ये लोग मरते तारे हैं कोबड़े. अदर हिट. These elements are not kept randomly. They are there to tell us a story subliminally. Is the biggest kept secret. Jeff, Adre, Daro, Aladdin. He has been put forth for it. Dunia. Dunia. All again. Bhaironath. Dunia means the world. By repeating certain motifs, the structure of the text is enhanced as it links various elements of the story to a central image. Adre, bekki ke gante ka to dhairiya. Ane ne urul se dibe. मुंग That's interesting. The big idre rana hatu garna kero. See, one of the biggest things about KGF is the dialogue. The dialogue is so well written, and you can see why. the 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 metaphors and everything that they they add in the dialogue and the way it's actually spoken. is one of the best things about the movie the dialogues are are fire man <coughs> even the name garuda it's an eagle right let's ask chat gpt about the theme of the movie kgf chapter 2 okay let's have some <laughs> <laughs> AI working here. If the movie has gone, <laughs> sorry. If the movie has a globe, a clock, a telephone as your symbols, uh, what is the visual motif of the movie? We even prompted the question differently. Wait, we're supposed to read it? I thought it was gonna read it out to us. Okay, so I'll read it to you guys. Here we go. The visual motive of a movie with the symbols of globe, clock, and telephone could be the theme of time and distance. The globe could represent the idea of distance, as it is a symbol of the vastness and the diversity of the world. The clock, on the other hand, represents time, which is often portrayed as a precious commodity in movies. The telephone could represent communication and the ability to connect with others, even over great distances. Together, these symbols suggest a theme of people attempting to overcome the obstacles of time and distance in order to communicate or achieve a goal. The visual motif may be used to underscore the importance of human connection, the power of determination, or the struggle against forces that seem to be working against the characters. Interesting. We even prompted the question differently, to which. Chat GPT give a new answer. Which is, I'm gonna read the last part only. Taken together, the presence of these objects might suggest a movie that explores themes related to time, communication, global interconnectedness, <clears throat> and the relationship between humans and the natural world. However, without more information, blah blah blah. Even Chat GPT, even Chat GPT wants to know which movie this is, and he it's interested in watching KGF. Pause the video to check this out. Even this time, I have counted the number of cuts in this movie, and that is five thousand six hundred and fifty nine cuts. I told you guys, man. 
I told you guys there are less wait 83.5% that's exactly the same there is a decrease in average shot length when compared to the first chapter yeah so I did mention that there were less cuts when I watched KGF chapter 2 and that's why I felt it was a slower pace some of you guys didn't agree when I said it but you know here is you know the facts here are the facts there were much less cuts frame by frame by the people. NFT For the proof of work that I have counted the number of cuts in KGF series, I have captured a screenshot of the best frame of a shot and have uploaded as an NFT. So the best frame of every shot in the KGF series has been uploaded as an NFT. I have been hearing for a lot of movies that every frame of this movie is like a painting. But when I really felt that for a movie, I uploaded all the shots captured as a screenshot as an NFT, a unique digital artwork. All the NFT has been uploaded with the name codes like film name, underscore chapter number. Okay, I'm not gonna promote NFTs, especially, I don't know if, I think you need authorization for that, right? Let me see what else. KGF is an example for great work of art, as you can come back to it over and over again and find greater and greater depth. One year of KGF chapter two. Just like a gold mine keeps giving us gold until we keep digging. <laughs> NTR thirty one. I heard that um, he left social media because um, people were were angry that he wanted to work on Telugu films instead of Kannada films. I think that's the, the main reason. You guys can explain better what happened, but um, I think that's what happened. Monster. Oh, may he rest in peace, this actor. Okay, so... What's coming next? Commerce of Salar, okay. <laughs> interesting, guys. That is very interesting. The, the whole concept of the... Um, the art of KGF is just incredible. You know, everything is very well connected and hey i want to i want to see the easter eggs i thought part one of this series i think was was a little bit more detailed and i i think i preferred the part one i think the editing was also better but part two was very you know it was very good as well you guys can go check out his channel the link is in the description and you can check out my reaction also i'm gonna put it somewhere over here um, but hey guys, if you have any other Easter eggs, things that you think might be a clue, let me know in the comments, I'll take a look at them. I, I love talking about, you know, um, KGF theories, predictions, and stuff like that. And I'm, I'm trying to see if I can make a video about that as well. 
4K Jeff Chapter 3, which is coming soon. <laughs> I don't know what soon means, but it's coming. Guys, thank you for watching. Danya Vada. Take care now. Bye-bye. See you soon.